Authorities are investigating in South Florida after a highway patrol officer was killed in the line of duty. Yeah, that tro trooper now identified as 26 year old Zachary Fink was trying to detain a felon on the run this morning. Well, she's the one on Munoz joins us in studio right now with how it all happened. Yeah, the governor's office says a trooper Zachary Fink died this morning in a crash on I-95 in St. Lucie County. FHP says Fink was trying to pull over the suspect who was driving recklessly on I-95 at around 3 o'clock this morning. The suspect tried to make a U-turn. Fink then followed him. That's when Fink collided with the driver of a tractor trailer. Both of them died. Dozens of law enforcement officers took part in a somber procession as the trooper's body was taken to the medical examiner's office. Officials say that he died fulfilling a childhood dream. His stepmother relayed to me that since he was six years old, all he's ever wanted to do was help people. And if you think about the manner in which he lost his life today, it was the very essence of helping people. Officials say the suspect continued on I-95 before getting into a crash and running away. He was eventually caught at around 8 o'clock this morning after a manhunt. Meanwhile, Governor Ron DeSantis issued his condolences on social media, saying that he and his wife are praying for the Fink family and the entire FHP community. Michelle? Okay.